You can leave me alone now. Yes, sir. Bro, Prez! Accompany me to Cassandra. That's no problem, Bro, Prez. She's still in her room, but she must be on her way out. Okay, let's go. Miss Cassandra, um, Miss Cassandra, may I talk to you for a little while? I have work to do. Um, but, um, <laughs> just for a few minutes. It won't take too long. If it concerns Mr. President, no thanks. Baby girl, will you forgive me, please? My real name is Cassandra, Mr. President, and not baby girl. I will just bring all the documents to your room now. Cassandra, look, the President's here now, on his knees before you. I love you. All right, but subject to one condition. Fulfill what you have promised. Drive away that Ellen out of the palace. <gasps> oh no, that's one thing I can't do. If I do that, people will ask questions, especially Arturo. There'll be bedlam inside the palace. Okay, Mr. President, I have things to do. Oh no, wait. I will stay away from Ellen. She'll no longer be able to enter my room. I'm not going to talk to her, let alone go near her. Is that for real? Yes, baby girl. You know that you're only my only baby girl. Very good. You'll have a surprise for me later. Oh. <gasps> Bro, press baby love, huh? So now, it's Ellen I have to work on. But you just said that Miss Cassandra is the only one you love, right? Come on, just do what I say. Yes, baby press. It's so easy to toy with you, Mariano. With just a little bit of acting, I got you running to me. I'll no longer be surprised if I can make you heal and grow over like a puppy when I tell you to.